During the pandemic, I've been asking everyone the same first question. So I'd like to ask you guys, what TV series would you love to guest star on? Ooh, What We Do in the Shadows. Yeah, The West Wing, I think. You didn't want to go with Gilligan's <laughs> Island? <laughs> I've never heard Gilligan's Island. That would be a new one. No. Okay. Well, there you go. Uh, I am curious. <laughs> I was looking at Jake, and I'm, I, I almost thought you were doing a Brady Bunch thing, looking up at the yeah, other no, window. No, no. <laughs> For each of you, um, have you ever been asked by a director, you really need to get this in one take? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So what was the... What was the last time someone said to you, we really need you to do this in one take? Well, I, you know what? Actually, I don't know if it's directly that, but I mean, I mean it depends because there, there are situations where you have 20 minutes, right? And we're losing, they're losing the light. Like when you're doing the kids are all right. And, and Josh Hutchison and I were playing ping pong. It was like, we just didn't have, we, we, we literally had 20 minutes and we were playing a ping pong game and doing a scene. It was like, we've got to get this because that's all we have. Um, but then there, there, are, uh, there are times when people are doing like a long, when there's a long, in, un, you know, uninterrupted camera move. And, and that, so there's that kind of a take. It's like, we need you to just do it, you know, all the way through. You just described every movie I've ever made, Steve. Right. Yeah, literally. <laughs> I don't know. I was like, you're like, have you ever done? And literally, that's the only movies I've ever done have been that. I, yeah. I do. I will say, though, I remember doing in uh, Donnie Darko, uh the f- opening shot of the movie is was we had one one opportunity to do it uh for sunrise and it was one take and we we shot it at the before it pre-production um and we had to all wake up i remember at like 2 a.m and drive out to the angels crest forest up to the top of this mountain and we had one take it was a steady camp and then there was a camera problem which we didn't learn about until three or four days after when the dailies were exposed. And we had to go back in the middle of shooting again on a random day and reshoot the opening of the movie. Cause we could only shoot it in one take with a particular kind of light. Before I run out of time, I got to ask you one question about the movie for each of you. What was it about this script, this story that said, I want to be a part of this. I love that it was about a little girl, you know, a little girl and her adventure and, and how the adventure sort of led her to finding herself and reconnecting with her father and remembering her mother. I was very touched by that. I w- would agree with Julianne. And I would also just say that I think, you know, some of my favorite stories, particularly children's stories, have a dark side to them. And this one has a sense of sort of uh, pain and longing of the loss of a, of a parent. And then, you know, reconciliation and healing and i was really moved by that too but but that the little girl was the reason that all these people uh could see themselves and change you know really really moved me um because i think it is in the end all about those who you know come after us and and that's what this movie is about how they teach us that note i gotta go uh congrats i hope you guys are both doing you know i hope everything goes well for you guys in the you know upcoming future. Thank Same you. to you, man. Thank Thanks, you. bud. Cool. Have a great day.